Hi, I'm Jeff Keyes, SPT, and with me is Dave Kittle, here to demonstrate improper and proper lifting methods. Thanks for being here. Thank you. All right, first thing we want to do is I'd like you to just lift that box up and put it down as you would on any given day. Dave is doing a few things wrong there that I'd like to point out. So would you mind demonstrating again? And then I'm going to pause halfway and point out things that we can correct. Stop right there. All right, as you can clearly see, Dave is bending with his back as opposed to using his knees. Also, his stance is very narrow, which is not very uh, good to do when lifting a box. And lastly, his arms are real straight and they're kind of out far from his body, which could also uh, put him at risk for injury. So can you lift it up and put it back down? All right, so now using those tips that I just gave you, bending with the knees as opposed to bending at the back, keeping that box nice and tight, close to your body, and keeping that back nice and straight and widening your stance to shoulder width apart. Can you lift the box one more time? Excellent, and that's how it's done. Uh, the second thing that we're gonna do is address lifting and carrying an object and placing it on a table, something that we do nearly every day. So Dave, let's lift the box up and then put it on the table, okay? Okay. Looks good. Dave is doing a few things that we could work on, so I'm going to have you do the same thing again. I'm going to pause you halfway and point out some things that we can correct. And stop right here. Just take a look at Dave's back. It doesn't look very comfortable, does it? Also, his arms are kind of still way out in front of him, not close into the body at all. And his uh, feet are still stuck in quicksand way behind him. Some ways that we can correct this is using the feet to do the motion instead of the back, keeping that box nice and close into the body, and using his knees to bend to lower the box as opposed to using his arms to place it. So you can put that back down, and we're going to use those tips to correctly put it on the table, OK? So one more time. Looks great. That's perfect. Some things that can cause injury when lifting boxes are poor technique, lifting a box that may be too heavy for you, and lifting it way too many times. So don't forget those, and have a good day.